Hello, welcome to Boodley Books. Today, Donnie the Dinosaur is with me, and we are going to read How Big Were the Dinosaurs? Really, really huge. Well, I think so. Well, like me. <laughs> yeah, well, a lot of them were bigger than you. Whoa. Hey, this is a book by Bernard Most. It has lots of dinosaurs in it. Oh, goody. D can I help say the names? If you can pronounce them, they're kind of hard. I don't even know if I'll get them all right. Well, let's try. Okay, we'll try. How big were the dinosaurs? Wow, look at all those. Cool. And look at the kids riding the dinosaur. Oh, I'm too small to do that. It's okay. You're a good small dinosaur. It's hard to imagine how big some of the dinosaurs really were. Some dinosaur footprints that have been found are so big, you and a couple of friends could stand in one of them. Or I could make one. Yeah, you could make a dinosaur footprint, a small one. Yeah. Just how big were the dinosaurs? Tyrannosaurus rex was so big, some of its teeth were as big as your toothbrush more than seven inches long. That's, that's me, that's Tyrannosaurus. Yeah, I wonder how many tubes of toothpaste it would take to brush this monster's teeth. Ooh. Triceratops was so big, its head was bigger than your front door. Even though this plant eater was one of the most peaceful dinosaurs, I don't think your mother would want it inside your house. Well, no. Well, yeah, he might have muddy feet. Well, yeah, but he might be so big that he'd make a mess inside, like breaking things. Oh, yeah. Shantungosaurus was so big, it was about 50 ducks long. It was one of the biggest duck-billed dinosaurs ever found. Wow. I bet it could make the loudest quack ever. Yeah, probably. Stegosaurus was so big, the plates on its back were larger than a school crossing sign. With all those protective plates, Stegosaurus would be a perfect crossing guard. Oh, yeah. Dinochirus was so big, its arms and hands together were nine feet long. Since that was all scientists ever found of this dinosaur, I wonder how much bigger the rest of it was. Wouldn't it be nice to have an extra pair of helping hands that size around your house? Oh, I don't know. It looks kind of scary. Yeah. Hypsilosaurus was so big, its eggs were the size of a hen. Even though this barn-sized plant eater was smaller than many other dinosaurs, its eggs were the biggest dinosaur eggs ever found. Wow. Do you think eggs that big would fit in an egg basket? Well, if the basket was really, really big. Oh, yeah, right. Superosaurus was so big, it was longer than a supermarket aisle. I bet this gigantic plant eater would have no trouble finding the vegetable section. Yeah, and eating everything. Yeah, he'd clear it out. How about calling this dinosaur Supermarketosaurus? Oh, yeah. Whoa, that's big. Ankylosaurus was so big, it was bigger than a school bus. This sturdy plant eater was covered with armor and weighed more than five tons. Ooh. Wouldn't you feel safe going to school on an enormous dinosaur bus? As long as it was not a carnivore. Oh, yeah. You'd have to be careful, right? Yeah. Allosaurus was so big, it was bigger than a bulldozer. This meat eater's jaws were hinged, so it was able to swallow large chunks of meat. Whenever I see the powerful jaws of an earth-eating machine, I think of Allosaurus. Yo, yeah, he's really, really huge. Potosaurus was so big, 
At one month old, it was bigger than a baby's crib. I bet it wasn't easy to babysit a six foot long, 75 pound baby Apatosaurus. I would not like to change his diapers. Ooh, yeah. Mm. Parasaurolophus was so big, the hollow tube at the top of his head was longer than a trombone. Some scientists think it blew air through this tube to make horn-like sounds. I wonder how it would have sounded in a school concert. Ooh. Diplodocus was so big, it was about as long as a basketball court. One of the longest dinosaurs ever found, it could have been nicknamed Stretch Lizard. Uh, I, I bet Stretch would have been able to slam dunk its head and its tail at the same time. Maybe. Baryonyx was so big, its thumb claws were as big as this book. Its nickname was Heavy Claw. Do you think this very large dinosaur would like to thumb through this dinosaur book? Oh, I think he might ruin it. <laughs> Probably. Mamenchiosaurus was so big, its neck was longer than a school flagpole. No other dinosaur or any animal that ever lived had a longer neck. I think this is a dinosaur worth saluting. Torvosaurus was so big, its toes were bigger than a man's shoes. Scientists named this large meat eater Savage Lizard because of the giant claws on its hands and feet. I bet you thought only grown-ups had big feet. Oh, no, I know dinosaurs have big feet, too. Oh, yeah, that's right. You knew that. Brachiosaurus was so big, it was taller than a giraffe, the tallest animal living today. A giraffe might need help from an elephant and a hippopotamus to reach as high as Brachiosaurus. Whoa, it's a really huge guy, too. Yep. Oh, my Asaurus was so big, it was longer than a bowling alley lane. Scientists think it might have had a bony club at the tip of its tail. It sure would be fun to go bowling with this dinosaur. Well, as long as he didn't uh, break everything. Yeah, steer right. Wait, wait, that's cheating. Oh, well, yeah, he really should use the ball, right? Yeah. Okay. Therizinosaurus was so big, its fingernails were almost as big as you are. Well, not you, but like a, a, a kid, like a first or second grader. Not much else is known about this big-fingered dinosaur. I wonder how long it would take to polish those huge fingernails. Oh, I think he would be embarrassed. Oh, to have pink fingernail polish? Yeah, I would be. Okay. Ultrasaurus was so big, its shoulder blade was longer than a park bench. If just one Ultrasaurus bone was this big, imagine how huge the whole dinosaur must have been. Whoa. Seismosaurus was so big. It was almost twice as big and weighed almost twice as much as a Potosaurus better known as Thunder Lizard. The name Seismosaurus means Earth Shaker Lizard. I bet you used to think Thunder Lizard was big. Whoa, that's huge. Yeah, maybe one day someone will discover a dinosaur so big it will make Earth Shaker Lizard look tiny. Whoa. And that's the end. Oh, so many huge dinosaurs. I feel very small. Oh, it's okay. It's okay to be a small dinosaur. But I have a really big appetite. You do. What do you want? Oh, you wouldn't have any peanut butter, would you? Little bit left. 
You want the rest of my peanut butter sandwich? Really? Yes, you can have it. Oh my gosh, wait, I want some milk. Oh, okay, uh, I'll get you some milk to go with it, okay? Thank you. You're welcome. Bye. See you.